Are you ready to create a song of your own? I bet you're going to do great. Here's some of the ways that I approach songwriting. It's a very simple process that I like to think of in four different categories. Intention and purpose. Secondly, using inner talent or inner resources. Thirdly, structure or song form. And fourth, realizing the full idea, executing it and delivering it. So let's talk about each segment. Firstly, intention and purpose. Why are you writing this song? What is it for? Is it for someone else? Is it for yourself to maybe calm yourself down or get focused about a particular project or help you to release resistance about somebody or something that you're working towards? Knowing what the intent is and the purpose behind this songwriting exercise will help you also define what the tempo is. What is the vibe of the song? Is it a happy song? Is it somber? Is it encouraging? Is it nurturing and calming? Once you've decided that, then you can start to think about the natural talent that you have, and everyone has these. I'm talking about breath, body percussion, mouth percussion, touch, 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 touch. Anyone can do that, and it gives you an immediate groove to your song. Then things like, what's around me? What's in my environment? Maybe a set of keys, which have this nice jingly percussive beat. Uh, maybe a saucepan with a, with a ladle. Or if you play an instrument, go for it, whether it's guitar or piano or a string instrument or a wind instrument, your options are really limitless. Ultimately, what we want to, to remember is that you have ideas. You have ideas every day. So tap into them and try not to judge yourself too much. You have nothing to prove, as we've mentioned time and time again. Then let's look at song form or structure. Repetition is your friend. One of my favorite songs of all time is the Beatles classic, Let It Be. What's their hook? Let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be. There will be an answer, let it be. It's amazingly effective, even though they've just used that one phrase over and over again, you feel like the message really drives home. One way to think of song structure is no structure at all. That's perfectly legit. Or you could say take a blues form, something like an A, A, B, A, where you state something once, that's your first A. You state it again, that's your second A. You slightly modify it, that's your B. And then you say it again to really underline your point, and that's A, 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 B, A. Whatever your song form, just make sure that you don't overcomplicate it and it still embodies the message that you want to send forth. And that brings us to the last point, realizing your idea, executing it, delivering it in whatever way, whether you want to record it or you perform it for someone, or it's just a feeling that you internalize and you sort of resort to whenever you need it. Ultimately, keep your intention clear, keep your eyes on that goal, the purpose behind which the song is created, and you'll be all set. Enjoy, have fun. This is an adventure.